This video will cover exporting references from an EBSCOhost database into Zotero on a Mac. To start things off, you will need Zotero on your Mac. If you have not had Zotero set up, be sure to check out the installation and setup video here. Once Zotero is set up, we can start at the library homepage to access an EBSCOhost database. We will be going to Databases and then All. From here, we can select Vendors slash Providers, EBSCO, and this will produce a list of paste subscribed EBSCO databases. In this example, I will go with Academic Search Premier, a multidisciplinary database. When accessing any database from off campus, you will be asked to sign in. Do so using your PACE portal credentials. Once logged in, enter a search in the search box. In my example, I use the search for retention in relation to engagement. In the search results, you can select results to export one of two ways. First, you can select specific articles of interest by clicking on the blue folder icon on the right of each result. Alternatively, you can select Share, Results 1-20 through 20, under Add to Folder. Once some references are selected using either approach, go to the top of the web page and select Folder. From here, you'll see a list of all the references that were selected. On this page, go to Export, located on the right side. By default, the settings selected will be Direct Export in RIS format, which is the correct format. On the left, you will see a checkbox asking if you would like to remove the items in the folder. If you plan on using the database further, it is recommended you check this box to prevent duplicate references from being exported. Depending on the web browser, your exported references will either appear as a file on the bottom of the page or in a new window. At this point, make sure that no windows, browser or Zotero, are in full screen view, the green icon. as this may lead to loading issues. Select a file to open in Zotero. Zotero will open and ask if you would like to place these new references in their folder or collection. You can name the collection at a later time by clicking on the Delivery folder and selecting Rename Collection. And there you have it, you have successfully exported references from an EBSCOhost database into your Zotero library. For any questions, visit asklibrary.pace.edu.